Context is making a comeback. In the industrial age, Western society began to consume beyond its means, believing industry and technology could free us from the confines of our ecosystem. We were wrong. A couple of centuries later, rising ocean levels, resource depletion, and a changing climate have proven we significantly impact the world we inhabit. But how can we raise that intuitive awareness in a generation of designers, architects, and engineers raised disconnected from that context? Living in a house that reveals its interconnections on every level could be a start. The textile house will join the grounds of the Domaine du Bois Boucher, which is an education community where design thinking meets international and interdisciplinary artists and designers. Our design will grow to accommodate 40 students for a new housing scheme and bring new emphasis to sustainability and renewable energy strategies. In the country setting, textile house will be a model for communities living in nature and become part of a larger whole where learning happens at multiple levels, not only in the workshop, but also at home and in the landscape. Single threads break under pressure, but a textile is formed when multiple threads share pressure. In the materials of our house, the approach is fundamentally similar. You take two opposing materials that seem to be in complete detriment to one another and bind them together in such a way that the forces repelling them, in fact, pull them together tighter. Our house has two specific approaches to energy. It adheres to the Passive House Energy Code and is constructed out of high-performance, pliable, flexible, lightweight textiles. Passive House is the highest international standard for energy-efficient houses. Passive House consists of a highly regulated envelope that is designed to avoid heat loss and take advantages of ambient energy in the environment itself. Passifal's strength is creating a stable and comfortable interior environment. Textiles are responsive to environmental pressures and can change at the substructural level. Flexibility allows the user to interact with space in the house with its environment. Textiles are flexible materials made out of woven and non-woven structures. And these materials can be made out of natural fibers such as cotton and wool, and synthetic materials such as glass fiber. Inside the house, new spaces can be created by gathering, stretching, and pulling fabrics along tracks. While outside the house, photovoltaic textiles will track the sun to harvest solar energy. The textiles and structural frame combined to create a system that has structured walls and a fixed state environment that is required to meet passive house standards. At the same time, this allows for shapes, spaces, and the possibility of adaptation that is extremely difficult with hard materials. Eliminating drywall and heavy materials means the house will be easily deployable, reducing costs and the carbon footprint. Our plan to assemble three different times in three locations without the use of heavy construction equipment will serve as a testament to the design's impact. Innovation is the pursuit of solutions. Sometimes those solutions already exist and need only be adapted to modern settings. Textiles are some of the oldest materials in human history, used for shelter and protection. What we're doing is celebrating that history, but also modernizing it by introducing air and water barriers to protect it and allow it to breathe, as well as solar photovoltaics on the outer layers to generate electricity. Our house uses proven technologies in new ways. In designing a home, material choices come first. By choosing to use textiles, we're addressing architectural convention with fresh eyes, maximizing performance and minimizing complexity. Because architecture is a synthesis of many different fields, all of which use their own language, it can be difficult when a change in one creates unexpected results in another. Using a new material, we are challenging ourselves to define what that material means in each discipline's language. This means that it will be developed from its inception with each discipline working in tandem. We want the next month's research to challenge the way designers search for answers. If materials dictate form, then we want to show the design community that there are more possibilities in these kinds of materials than what our past assumptions have led us to believe. The energy industry is at a moment of intense diversification. Never before has there been so great a demand for new answers nor such a willingness to receive them. The Solar Decathlon provides a forum for professionals and students to trade information and practical knowledge, an exchange that often stops at the professional barrier. Textile House is above all a learning tool.